when I was a little girl, I used to spend lots of time cutting things out of my mum's catalogues. And those things were things I imagined I might have in the future. Uh, they consisted of handsome men and small children and soft furnishings mostly. <laughs> To want something, you really have to be able to imagine it. And to be able to imagine it, you have to have some element of experience in it. And for many of our children, that experience is limited. So those children need someone to be imagineers for them. And I think that's one of the things that education should be about. It should be about building possible futures for children and scaffolding and tooling that possible future until they've reached a point where they can dream and imagine for themselves. Sometimes those dreams might seem inconceivable or impossible. And it's a teacher's role to show children that no matter where they came from, or no matter what they've experienced, the possibility always exists. And I think that dream unites everyone across the education spectrum, regardless of whether they come from right or left.